Well, I learned so much from Let's Go Help members and from people who watch my videos on YouTube. <laughs> now, here's a lady uh, from Texas. She was on, I was live streaming this morning on, on YouTube and had a nice chat with everybody. Actually, I was about 45 minutes or something. It was nice and get the feedback. Uh, but here's what happened. And she she wrote a uh, text me when I was live saying, hey, you really helped me. Thanks a lot and everything. So she did a lot of research, too. I mean, and, and I want to read you what you wrote, because this is what you have to do. I mean, so many people, particularly even on Let's Go Help members, I'm trying to convince them how you have to go to more than one place. You, know, uh, you have to <laughs> not expect to just make one phone call or one website and you're going to solve all your problems. That doesn't happen. Okay, here's what she meant. I mentioned to your Facebook page. Oh, she's also a Facebook member. <laughs> that's wonderful. Well, maybe that's why she was able to do this. Uh, I don't know. Anyway, uh, and your YouTube channel, I received assistance. Yay! I had applied for three assistance programs. Now, listen to this. She applied to three different places, city, county, and state. Okay? Applied to three different places. I got two that paid me my rent and two utilities for three to four months. Wow, <laughs> isn't that great? So of the three places, one of them gave a rent. Uh, let me finish that. Story. I was requesting for a month of assistance due to having a much needed surgery that was going to set me back a month with uh, my tight budget. Then I got sick uh tested positive for COVID-19 okay <laughs> so she was in trouble health-wise and financial rise because she's on a real tight budget I was approved for four months of assistance for rent $325 like this and seven months for two utilities at $179 a piece so she got two uh, $179 a piece uh, for seven months. And that's like, uh, what, like $2,500. So she got $3,000, $2,500. That's like uh, $5,500 you know, she got. I'm also, now this is this, this is another bonus. Bam, bam, bam. She got the bonus. <laughs> what do we have for her, Larry? <laughs> uh, I know also, uh, I know also fixing my credit through the community development program. Okay. She found another program that will fix her credit, all free, okay? A community development program for financial education and homeowners workshop counseling, okay? That's what I recommend all the time. They're all over the country. They sit down with you for free and help you with the credit so you could buy a house, okay? <laughs> and that's the important thing. Free for anyone interested in our county. You don't even have to be long living in the county now. You wanna move to the county maybe, you know, no promises, <laughs> and they give you but every county has this. Yeah, this is right. They sit down, you know, you're worried about your credit, you have lousy credit, whether you want to buy a house, you get free counseling here and fix your credit. And then she goes on. Now, this is the great. <laughs> Thank you for the links and the information. God bless you for helping others. Well, that's always wonderful. Uh, thank you, Matthew. Now, see, that? I mean, this, this is what it's about. Uh, it's about, you know, doing effort. You know, I can't do it all. I show you where it's most likely to happen. See what we do on Let's Go Help. I show you uh, the, okay, here's where to find free help to get credit fixed, okay? Here's where to find uh, free money to fix up your, or to pay your back utilities, okay? And then maybe even, I don't, not sure they have it, but this is the place that should have it if you have it. See, I can't guarantee everything. Nobody can guarantee you money except the people handing out the money. So I show you the places and give you the sources of the places that are most likely in your area to have the money because there are hundreds of thousands of sources all over. And there's no way I can keep all this stuff. But I show you what I've learned through 40 or 50 years of research, how you could find these places because it follows a pattern. And if you're doing it for the first time, it may take you 40 years to find the pattern. So I figured out the pattern, but you still got to do the work. <laughs> and that's what counts. You know, you taking what I do and when I narrow it down and you following up, you have to follow up. Like I could tell you where the single people hang out, but I can't arrange a date for you. You got to go there and ask yourself and you may or may not get one. <laughs> it's the same way, you know, with getting a job. I can't get you a job, but hey, these people are hiring over there. Now, whether you hire you or not, you'll have to find out.
Say, so hey, these people are most likely places that are going to give money grants to solve this problem. Now you got to go and figure it out and see what happens. Okay. And you're, you know, a lot of people were, well, what am I going to say? I, I don't know how to, you don't just be human, human, go human. These are human people that you talk to. That's why it's best to talk to them because they're human. You're typing, uh, you don't know what to say. And I, I don't even know. I flunked English in college. So I'm not good at words either. <laughs> I can talk. <laughs> we all can talk. And you don't have to be a Sharpie. You don't have to be anything. You just have to be human and nice, you know, and you don't have to know what you want. You just have to say and never say, hey, I want a grant. I want, you know, because that, that, that's so aggressive and, 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 and not friendly to them. See, the people who are giving out the money. They actually have a wonderful job because they help people in trouble. Man, that, that's like being a doctor, right? And that's a wonderful satisfaction, I think, of, of a profession to have. You're going to, people come to you, they have a pain, a problem, and they fix it. Wow. To help people like that one on one, that's what they're like. These people handing out the money are doctors to your financial help, you know? And, and so that's why uh, it's nice. So that's why you don't yell at them, don't whatever. Don't, they don't see, they know your problem better. If you just say you have a problem, if you say you need a grant, well, you know, they don't understand your problem. So you have a problem and need help fixing it. That's how you start the conversation and go on from there. It doesn't take magic. doesn't take a lot of money. doesn't take a lot of knowledge. <laughs> All it takes is a phone. You don't even need me on the line. <laughs> and, and because then if they say, oh, no, we can't help you with that. You know, uh, you have funny looking eyebrows or something. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> and whatever they say that no, then you say, hey, do you know somebody else that could maybe help me? Because, you know, they're going to know better than you'll ever know. Who else in their community uh, does this kind of work? Because they do it. They do it every day. They, they go to meetings. They talk to people. Other people call them and ask for help. And they tell them what they got somewhere else. So they're the best source you have to keep going on your, you know, your struggle or your, your <laughs> research on how to find you help just for you. So that's why it's very important to use the phone. It's very important that there's no one place. So just sit back. Get on the phone and see what happens.